All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back or welcome to the channel. If you're new, I'm JFammer David. Today, we're going to solve the problem of where the heck do I find my potions and how the heck do I use them? We're not going to get in too much brewing. We're just going to basically get into those two things. So let's dive in. You want to open up your settings, to the book, whatever you want to call this. And no, it's not going to be under your inventory. This is so annoying. I'm not sure why they did it like this. It's under collections. Now, as you hover over these things, you'll see it at the bottom, it shows what they are. Wand handles, conjurations, traits. Right here, tools, potions, and magical plants you have collected. So here's all your potions. It shows you, you know, what you need to do to have to the recipe for them, the brewing time, all the things that you, you have equipped and have found. I need three more that I have not found. So this is how you know if you actually have the item. Now, what you want to do is go back, just to the gameplay. Now, if you look at the left-hand side, for me it says L1, that little icon. If you're on keyboard or mouse, I'm sorry, but whatever that icon is, you want to hold that. So for me, I'm going to hold L1. It's going to bring this wheel up. So for everything that the game enables you to use, is already equipped on the wheel. So you don't have to worry about that. But you can see that there's numbers, 2, 0, 1, 0. So that me that's my count for the amount of potions I have. So if I take my R1 stick and I push up and I put it on this one, it'll show me that it's an Eteris potion and it'll show me the recipe for it. And I also have two and it says the duration. It lasts 20 seconds, a potion that enhances the drinker's defense by covering them with a durable rock skin, which by the way is a really cool potion. So all you have to do if you notice, if I let go of the right stick, it'll unhighlight it like for in three seconds. So now it goes away. So what you want to do is while that's highlighted, you could either hold the right stick and let go of L1 and it's going to equip this potion. That's how you do it. Or you can hold L1, tap R in the direction of that potion or like this one. And while it's still highlighted, let go of L1. There it is. So you have the potion. Now, you notice that there's one in the right hand side that's yellow that has a zero on it if you hold l1 and you hit x because it corresponds with that potion now you can see i have equipped that potion so that's how you do it i know it's kind of annoying but that's the the way they designed the game and i hope this cleared up some confusion for you and they're also just a quick tip before you go there's a mission where you have to drink two potions at simultaneously so it's a mission that they want you to do that. All you have to do is see this potion has a 20 um, second duration. All you do is equip that really quick and then you drink it. So all you have to do is to drink, you hit L1 again. I'll just burn one to show you. So you see L1, that's a really cool potion. And see how the timer is going down? All you have to do is hurry up and equip another one and then you drink that one. And that's how you drink two potions simultaneously. So hopefully that helped you out. And if you enjoy long form content, we're doing a complete gameplay walkthrough on the channel where we walk through the game. That's a lot of fun. Other than that, have a fantastic day.